Hey guys, welcome back to another video. This is episode I think 13. It should be actually, it might be episode 12 of the Soviet Union Let's Play. It doesn't really matter because today we are going to end the Let's Play. It is the last day I can record, so this is basically it. I pushed a great deal into Sinkang, took uh, Urumqi and Wusu, even their capital and uh, you know, I'm gonna keep pushing, I guess. So Afghanistan joined the war and I pushed in a little bit into them too. I could keep pushing, I could take out Xinjiang, Mongolia, Afghanistan, Manchukuo declared war finally. But you also, we also fall soon, so yeah, that's bad, but it's alright. We're gonna send reinforce. Well, I would send reinforcements and take them out. It would be entirely possible to handle the entirety of the Asian front now. The Middle Eastern Front is basically done, this is like nothing, same if Turkey we just took the entirety of their army out and everything they have, beyond basically all their cities other than two over here which we can take very quickly, and we have enough units to take them out. So I mean we won, tomorrow we can see armies I think, <clears throat> worth to see but uh, but I'm probably not gonna be around for that. Yugoslavia still has this little bit, but we basically took out everything, so it doesn't really matter. We had a decisive battle over here with Italy, they had a lot of troops here, and we won at the end. So that was a pretty big battle. We have Albania, we have Greece, we have Yugoslavia, Romania, Bulgaria, basically all of Turkey, Persia, Iraq, a lot of Syria, and the entirety of Poland, basically the entirety of the Baltics. A lot of Asia, even the parts of Mongolia, Tang, Tuva, Xinjiang, so on. Finland too and we pushed heavily into Sweden and I bet I could easily take both them and Norway out within like two days. So Scandinavia would be secured, Germany has great relations, I can walk into Danzig, they have nothing left, we bombed the shit out of their country and that's just about it. So at this point we won here in Slovakia too. So. We'd be able to take Danzig, Slovakia, the entirety of Scandinavia, the rest of Yugoslavia out and even Italy without much of a problem, Turkey would be done soon, Syria, uh, Egypt is now inactive, I think they just went a couple yeah. hours ago, uh, I think we'd be able to push them out too, even if that's unfortunate, we'd do great in Asia, and I think we would actually win this game since our production is so insane, I think very quickly we'd find ourselves with a great and secured uh, European front as Danzig and Slovakia would be done for soon enough uh, we'd basically deal with Italy at least set up a defensive line at Trieste or something so that'd be safe if uh, we don't want to get bombed we'll just uh, set up a defense here in the, this province and uh, something like that Hungary and Germany have great relations with us basically the best in the game at 72% with Germany and 70% for Hungary which are constantly going up slowly but surely. So we just take out basically everything without a problem, even Egypt and Italy too. I don't doubt that, even France and we could easily win this since our production is so insane. We have 250 or so units and we have 710 points with basically an insane economy. We make 400,000 money every single day. 15,500 an hour, we basically rose from the ashes by the way, we were almost, well we were at a real danger when Finland pushed heavily into the north of our, of our country, we were at war with Poland, the Baltic, Sweden, God knows what, not Turkey, you know I thought we would actually be at an extreme threat, thankfully we were able to fight them off even Moscow fell, it was bombed to shit. Same with like a lot of our cities, Minsk, Leningrad, Vologda, Arkhangelsk, Ivanovo, Moscow, even Stalino, we're still building them up and we haven't even built them back up entirely, so yeah. We also make a lot of manpower, an insane amount of resources, we make 2000 of goods and food every single hour, which is insane production. But yeah, that's this game, uh, it was great, I'm proud of it. And I hope you guys enjoyed it, I certainly did, and a lot, I learned a lot from it too, and it was a great game altogether, I wish I had more time, because if I did I could take out Germany, the entirety of Europe, and Asia too, without a doubt, right, I just need a bit of time, so yeah. Anyway, that's gonna be it for this video, thank you guys for watching the entire Let's Play, it's been very fun, and I will see you guys 
very soon. Goodbye.